What's up TRG gang? We back with another video and in today's video I'm taking you guys on a little vlog with my sister. We're gonna go to Applebee's and have a little date. Um, right now I'm about to go do my hair. I just got out the shower and got dressed and stuff. So I'm gonna take y'all on my little, I'm gonna do a little skincare routine and I'm just gonna straighten my hair with the Revlon um, blower thing i'm gonna probably put it in like time lapse or something so you guys can see how i do my hair and also a little makeup because i haven't done my makeup in a little while and i kind of want to feel cute so yeah and then we're gonna go to applebee's so i'll see you guys in a little while hi say hi say my name is raven and i'm one i'm a big girl you have a big girl Okay, grabbing my hair. You don't want to say hi? Say hi. Why do you want to say hi? You mean? Say hi. Hi. You tell them. She's rude, guys. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. I love you. My baby. What's up, guys? I'm back. I finally finished my hair. Well, finished blow drying it. Um... This is how it looks, but I'm about to pass the iron, the flat iron through it a couple times to get it really straight how I want it. And then I'm going to show, come back and show you guys my skincare routine and what I do for my acne prone skin. Wish I was born with some beautiful skin like some of you girls, but I wasn't. But it's okay, we're going to work for it. Period. But yeah, I'll come back when my hair is fully, fully done. I just wanted to show you guys. This is um, as straight as I could possibly get it with the um, with the blower brush thingy. So I'll see you guys back when my hair is fully done, so I can show you what I do to this um, acne prone skin of mine. See what I feel. Hey guys, I'm back in my bathroom again, but I just finished um, going through my hair with the um sorry if you hear noise in the back my family's here but um i just finished going over my hair so i'm gonna show you guys my skincare routine the lighting in here isn't that good and the only reason why i'm not filming in my room is because my cousin and my sister's in there right now they're both watching shows so you can basically hear everything okay so first the first thing I do is I wash my face with African black soap, but I already did that when I was in the shower. So the second step that I do, my witch hazel water is almost done, guys, but I use witch hazel water and a cotton pad and I just cleanse my face because witch hazel water, believe it or not, helps a lot with pimples and discoloration of your skin and stuff. So ever since I've been using this, a lot of my marks have lightened up. I have like acne scars this is a pimple guys don't mind that but i always get a pimple on my cheek you I, as you guys can see my problem areas are kind of my cheeks so everywhere else doesn't really give me a problem so yeah what i'm gonna do is take my witch hazel and So now that that's done, my face is super sensitive as you can tell. It gets red like like that. But um so I'm gonna let this dry a little. Gonna let it dry. After I let the witch hazel dry, I put this BAM pure rose hip seed oil. This is really good for acne. It's a oil that is high in I think little, I don't know how to say it, linoleic um, acid. So it's really good for people who have acne prone skin because this is an oil that's not oily. You know what I mean? Certain oils are oily. Sorry guys, I keep like adjusting y'all, but um, yeah. So I put a few drops of this on my face and you guys are going to tell like it's oil, but it's not oily like other oils are. Yeah, so 
So then I let this sit in my face for a little bit. I don't know if you guys could see. The lighting in here is kind of bad, but I let it sit in my skin for a little while before doing any like makeup to my face. So yeah, we'll be back in like five minutes. After I let the um, oil sit on my face, I go in with my Milk Hydro Grip Primer. I just bought this. I bought the small one because the big one is $30 and I didn't know whether I was gonna like it or not. So I bought the small one, but the small one has a lot of product in it too. So yeah, I'm just gonna pump this, pump a little bit on my hands. So yeah, I also let that sit for a little bit because, you know, you don't want to keep piling on things and doing it without it being dry. I'm going to see if I can do my makeup in the screen, guys. Oh, look, now you guys can really see what I'm talking about, but there's no bumps on my face. It's just I have acne scarring. Except for over here because, you know, this is actually a pimple. But I go before I was like really insecure about people seeing my face without makeup on. Like when I first started YouTube, I didn't want people to see my face without makeup. I always would do my makeup before my videos. But like to be honest, nobody's perfect in this world, and a lot of people suffer from acne. A lot of models, because I model, and like I used to be feel discouraged because I thought like, oh my god, I have to have a beautiful. F well, my face is beautiful. I'm beautiful, but like their skin is so flawless and stuff. But as you get older, you kind of learn that like they get their makeup done by the best people who know how to put the little bit amount of makeup but make it look good. So you know, I learned that. Even the ones who say they're perfect, don't be perfect. So yeah, anyway, so now I'm going to go in and do my eyebrows. I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Dip Brow in the color Dark Brown. To be honest, I will tell you what brush this is, but I don't even know because I don't use fancy brushes, to be honest. Like, I don't. They do the same job as the brushes that are more high end. That's, so then I'm gonna go in with my LA Girl. I don't know if you can see that. LA Girl Pro Conceal in the color Pure Beige. And this brush that I got from Rite Aid. Really good. No, I think I got this from the beauty supply. Might have been the beauty supply. Most likely the beauty supply. I might do this off camera because I need to focus here. So I'll be back with my eyebrows done. Okay guys, so I'm back. Here's my eyebrows. They actually came out really nice today and I'm really happy with how they came out. So the next step that I do is I usually set the concealer um, on my eyes with some translucent powder. I use this one, the airspun one. So I take this brush that is fluffy, you know, I don't know. This one, I think this one was from Rite Aid. <laughs> Remember I had said earlier that the other one was from Rite Aid. I think it was really the one that I'm using now. Yeah, just take it and just pat that in. I don't take too much because I don't want it to look like too much. I 
was like, I really need to, I need to realize space. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm not even with the eyes right now, because I don't have pretty eyes. You know what I mean, you guys, you know what I mean? Um, she's, she's... So, um, yeah, so that's what I was saying. Um, I don't know what it's going now, I mean, usually I put on my eyelashes, but I'm going to save that for last since I'm kind of showing you guys my routine. Um, now, I'm going to go in with my NARS. I love this. I have four of these, guys. Four. I'm obsessed. But um, this one's in the color Vanitu. I had to get a new one because I got light. I'm gonna mix this with the pure beige one and put it under my eyes. I learned this new thing on TikTok because I used to do um I used to do like a V shape underneath my eyes, but you know they saying that this works better, so we trying this. Oh my god, why am I so messy on one side and the other side looks like beautiful? Don't mind me, guys. I just add a little bit of this one just to bring it up a little more. Just to mix it. Mix it. Mix it, mix it, mix it. Mix it. Are you gonna fix it? I know y'all remember that, that song. But now I'm gonna go in with my translucent powder and my beauty. This is my old beauty blender, and I'm just gonna use that this one to so go underneath my eyes. Mm -hmm. So wow, my under eye is baking. I take I'm gonna take this brush and then this NARS little contour thingy that I got for my birthday, they gave it to me for my birthday guys. Okay. 
you got to fix this here. I should have just used the one that I normally use. Bam. So then I go back into powder. Take this. Oh wow, powder got in my freaking. I'm gonna take it off for the fluffy brush from underneath. Oh. So now I'm taking my Milani blush with this brush right here for lime. So now I'm gonna take this is actually a Morphe brush. Um M510. I'm gonna take it and dip it into my fancy trophy wipe, you already know. Look how pretty that is. Guys. Bam. Okay guys, so that's it for my face. So now I'm gonna go in with the Too Faced Hangover um three in one replenishing primer and setting spray and I'm just gonna set my whole face with this. So yeah guys, um, that was it for my little natural look, get ready with me, but I'm about to go pop my lashes on and we're gonna head to Applebee's, see you guys there. Yeah, because I got something to tell you about these fucking bitches and these fucking niggas right here too. They had me out here for 30 minutes, waiting for them and still not sitting their asses down to eat. Yeah. I'm disowning y'all, y'all done, y'all. So we here at Applebee's patiently waiting to get seated. Uh, Somebody decided they couldn't get a table. Be well, exactly. As she was sitting here for 30 minutes before exactly. us and, and decided us. Exactly. She decided that she didn't even want to tell them nothing about us going. No table, no nothing. So the wait time is 30 minutes. And if we Thank would have had an hour. <laughs> and if we would have had a table, right? And y'all wasn't here. Bro, I would have flew. We all live right have, there. Y'all should have flew when I said I was here. I said 55. I, like, I don't know why you yelling at me. You should yell at Ali because you didn't text me. You didn't text me. She decided that she wasn't going to call out of all days. Oh, whatever. It's oh, my own. God. Now it's so, so many excuses. Yeah, pretty much. So this is what we're doing. Ray, you want to be in the vlog or no? I'm very cold. To Me too. We about to go into Starbucks to wait a little because it's kind of cold out here, y'all. So yeah, I'm gonna check back in when we actually inside. Yeah, just giving y'all a little update. 
and also another update I put my lashes on and my left eye is poking the hell out of me like the hell but you know I'm trying to make everything positive because it got off to a bad start but it's gonna turn out better it's not how it starts it's how it ends like Ray said What is it? I don't want to taste salad because you say it's nasty. You say it What is it supposed to taste like? <laughs> like mangoes. I like mangoes, so. Go ahead, Ray. Nah, it's good. I'm not going to lie. It's that good. Nah, she's that not lying. It's that she's that was lying. It's that good. <laughs> Alright, nah, I'm going to try. I mean. Let's see how the Leo's reaction. <laughs> okay guys so this is the end of the vlog i'm about to go upstairs um yeah we just left applebee's basically actually went home and my sister's about to go home and i'm about to go upstairs sorry for the train i live by the metro north but i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog like comment subscribe comment what you want to see next love you guys bye Thank you.